Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, I'll be teaching you guys how to properly fix a problem with Discord where um, your friend is unable to join your Discord server when you're a mod or an admin to that server. So without further ado, let's have read it. So to actually do this is quite simple, and it doesn't really matter what platform you guys are on. You could be on the browser site for Discord, like I am right now, or the actual Discord app for your PC. Um, the steps should remain the same, so you should be good to go. So the thing with this is um, if a friend of yours is unable to join a Discord server, it's most likely because um, the link to or the invite link is expired. So whenever they click on it, it'll say that the link is expired. However, um, there's actually a way to fix this without having to generate a new link. And what you guys need to do is you need to head on over to your server. So this is my server. Obviously, this is a dummy one. And you, where you want to be at is the server settings. So to get there, you'd want to click on uh, the name of your server, like so. And then you want to click on invite people. So just like this. And normally what's going to happen is um, Discord is going to generate an invite link for your server. Now, you guys actually have the option here to um, set the link to never expire by ticking the box, just like so. But by default, you should know that the links provided by Discord um, go for, for as long as seven days, so one week. However, if you want to set a custom date for this, you could also do so too by clicking on the gear icon at the bottom right of the window, like so. And this should show you, or I should say, this should take you to the link settings. So um, the configuration that you can do to the invite link is the duration, or I should say um, the expiry date, as well as the max number of uses, as well as temporary membership. So by default, it's set to seven, but you guys can set it to one hour, six hours, um, 30 minutes, 12 hours, one day, or never. And then you can also set the max number of users to no limits or 100 users. So this way, um, anyone anyone with the link, um, once they reach 100 or 100 people have joined the server, the link will no longer work. So to actually let your friend into the server, you can configure this to set it to never. And that's basically going to do the trick. And the same goes for um, the max number of users. You can actually set it to just, um, you can, let's say that, uh, You've previously set it to 25 users and it's reached its limit. So you can set it to 50. So that way your friend can join. And then you're going to click on generate new link, send them the link, and that should be good to go. Or rather, uh, they can just click on the same link with your updated settings. So yeah, that's the video. So hopefully it helped you guys out. And if it did, be sure to let us know down in the comment section below. So thank you all for watching the video. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.